Hello everyone and welcome back for some more Wolfric the Wanderer in S4 Grim Hammer 2. And last episode we, uh, well, the champions or legendary lords as they are, just came out of the woodwork. So I think we got like two or three <laughs> God's Gifts last episode, which was pretty neat. I didn't even have to hunt them. Like we killed Vol uh, Volkmar right in the beginning and then they just kept coming. Well, I guess it was just... Well, I guess we killed two last episode. Either way, they... <laughs> They've just been throwing armies at us. We took Castle Drakenhof to recover a little bit. And we're just going to sit here one more turn just so we can fully recover because uh, we're not going to have much opportunity to. Maybe if we have a look here and take that, but we're going to start going north because I want to kill Clan Mulder. They are... I was fine just leaving them be. They were fighting, fighting Kislev and um, they didn't bother us. But then they declared war, go, went and raised this, so Throg is gonna go deal with that. He's gonna... Well, they probably took this. So we're gonna rinse out some rats over here. And then he's gonna go west, because fucking a goal attacked us. And I don't... Hordes are no match for the bloodthirsty warriors of the tribes. I don't even know why. <laughs> Seems like such a bad move for them to attack. And um, Hawkland attacked after we declare we made peace like last like two episodes ago, and I gotta say that's not a lot of turns that's been going because we've been doing a lot of manual fighting. So I'm a little bit annoyed because they should have they should have a very low reliability, and everyone should just start start. Uh, uh, cutting ties with them and declaring wars on them like they would if I would have done it because uh, That just seems unfair, but I guess uh, that's just how this works um, We're just gonna Right this didn't matter uh, Because we don't really have any skin wolves in this army. So let's just give you more speed and cash replenishment We'll give this guy Keep getting that Oh, right, and before we pass, we are gonna get some whalers, because the whalers are fucking cool. And then we pass. Actually, did we... Excuse me. Did we move... No, we did not move you. Um, so, we are gonna get the Mistwalkers, because they are awesome. Let's just get rid of a Marauder Javelin. That's fine. Get these. We can almost get the, get the Hounds back. Don't know if that matters but we are we're just gonna move 26 because there are probably Skaven in here or are there get in there search the ruins I want to see if there's Skaven in there yeah okay Brom is in there Good. I'm glad that he's there. That means uh, we don't have to chase him around. We can sit there and uh, raid him a little bit. Well, actually, we're raiding us, but... Um, the upkeep is better that way. And... Did we... Yeah, it was camp raid. Good. And I guess we should start building some of these money buildings here. I've been neglecting this too much. I should really have been doing this much more because this is gonna make us quite a bit of money so I should have just been doing this good to be honest, and hey I'd you be raiding, but you have my time you want all of these things I will give these to you if you join my war against a goal because um, that's you're gonna be a good distraction for them, and maybe Hochland. How about Mung? <laughs> yes. Ah, dang it. Okay, fine. Um, let's not include that then. Okay, let's not include Mung then. Okay, fine. Don't. No. Okay. You know what we're gonna do? You're not very aggressive right now, so we're gonna do this anyway. Whoops. Uh, we're gonna get you on a military alliance. And you should really 
probably not like Bjorn Sundling now. So maybe you'll declare war on, on them or something. What are your opinions of each other? Yeah, so you kind of hate each other. No. Well, now they're gonna start disliking them. Tell me. How about you? Have you, um, you want a defensive alliance. And you really want a military access. So if you just join my war against a goal. No? Fool. Fine. I can bend you to my will. As I can any creature. Let's do the defensive alliance. I want to drag you into shit. We might be dragged into other stuff, but oh well. It's fine. I'm gonna have to go north anyway, so... Whoops. Wait, who is this? Um, You want thick skin anyway. Yeah, and they keep taking our outposts. Bastards. Well, this is at least just a rebellion that is gonna fail because they're just setting tiny little goblins at us, so that's good. I'll gladly take some money. But, in truth, these are just gonna be... Uh, these are just buffer anyway, so they're doing their job. And that bastard little rat ran away from us, but we're gonna take back Winter Pyre either way. But, we're pushing them out of here, and I don't know if a goal we're moving any. Let's just upgrade that. We can upgrade that too. We have so much money. Um, they haven't made a move yet, so that's good at least. It's this guy I'm a little bit worried at, but he's gonna take a little bit before he starts going towards us. And he's taking a lot of attrition over there, so... That's good. Oh, they don't seem to do be doing very well. Kislev is pushing them out of there, because I'm pretty sure this was probably those. And that, that is a Norskan race, so I think help it is all they have. I could have just checked that instead of <laughs> went through all that. But that's good. But we are healthy with Wolfric. We can go and just kill everything in Eshen. And we need three more before we can finish just uh, finish sacking everything. But I'm in no rush because once we fill this, we're gonna be attacked by uh, three armies uh, of chaos, well, warriors of chaos. And they're all gonna be up in Norska, so we kind of don't want to have raised too much on the way there because I don't want them to spawn until we're kind of in position. So we're just gonna sack this for 7k, which is also... I'm very fine with that. And I mean, we don't need to raise this, but it's fine. Bald enough on the other hand, maybe that needs to be raised. And... Any reason we want to protect this? Like, we can do this, but... I don't see them taking this, but I mean, why not? Might as well. Anything that gives us some good garrison? Nah, not really. So, we'll pop this. We'll... Oh, that's a... It's a waste of money. There's no point. My next so, let's just keep killing things. We're gonna stop and recruit in just a second. Oh, this is quite the garris garrison, but we'll be... That's more damage than I was hoping for, but oh well. And now we can just destroy this. This we race though. Yeah. Okay. Fuck Waldenhof. In camp, and <laughs> we are taking more damage than we need to, but how long do we need to sit down to get whalers? Where's the whalers? Uh, where's the whalers? There's the whalers. Okay, it takes two turns. So, yeah, I mean, what? Where would, where else would we sit? Might as well sit here. I mean, it's probably better to sit down in, um, in Castle Drakenhof. But, who cares? We're sitting here, we're replenishing plenty. We're gonna have to sit here for two turns anyway. And is it time to get rid of these for another one of these? 
They do have quite a bit of weapon strength. <laughs> Damn, but they are always, always hurt. What else would we get rid of? I don't want to get rid of any of the champions because I think they are just better than the Berserkers. Mostly just because they're tankier. And I do enjoy having a tanky frontline. So... We get rid of this. Worst case, we can just get them back in 10 turns. And it's not gonna be a big loss. And there shouldn't really be any, <laughs> any real armies around. Because we've absolutely, like, destroyed the Vampire Counts. They're not gonna send anything. So we're, we're fine here. Oh, and we're almost at 30. So we almost have the Regiment of Renowned uh, Mammoth. And we got Deadly Onslaught. So we're just gonna go down the Red Tree now. Excellent. And keep going down that. You can have... Eye of the Bale Fiend is fine. Good. We did move Throg. This was this turn, right? Just gotta check. Yeah, okay. Let's level Throg. Um, so this is pretty good. Make him an absolute tank. Like, Well, he is already a tank, but 13k? That is pretty good. Shilling Aura is also pretty good. Do you not already have Terror? You don't. Okay, Shilling Aura and Terror is very good. Get that. Okay, so, are they moving? No, they're still sitting there, so we're fine. They're still on the on the border, or the shore, so we're fine. Let's... Oh. There's definitely Skaven in there, right? Because they... The... <laughs> the monument is gone! Definitely. There's no way there's not... A Skaven in there. So, we're actually just gonna go over there. You're gonna go and have a look again. Yep. Hello, Brom. Did, did you settle this? You should. Yeah, you should be pretty hurt. You okay, buddy? I don't think you are. Oh, that's a good one. Although we... Nah, this one is better. Ritualistic Fury is better. Oh, and you really need hardened skin. And you also need hardened skin. You should have gotten these for you for a while ago. Those are great. Good. So just sit there and recruit. Everything will be fine. Let let th let Throg Daddy just deal with you. What do you want? Oh, okay. Hello, dwarves. Um, could you could you bring out Ungrim? Oh. I very much would like to kill him. But, I mean, I'm not gonna go in and chase because he can be, like, over here. I don't know. Or all the way over there. I don't know. And there goes the last outpost from, uh, what, what are they called? Middleland, of course. Revenge of the Todd. Oh, but Rakarth is... is carving a piece out of the so empire for himself brother, that's great did, but you have my time yeah well oh shit <laughs> they have they've been pushing well that's awesome love it oh um what did we finish all right it was this one yeah so this is <laughs> this is gonna take so long might have to go and take altorf back when we're done with that but that's okay do we just force march north? Well, we're at least gonna move so we have the option to force march north. So let's just go over there. If I happen to see uh, Asag, and we are gonna just pounce on him, but yeah. Let's just... Is that all the extra movement we get? That's not a lot, but oh well. We still move... Moved pretty far. <laughs> that is pretty respectable. Because I was wanna, I just want to get to help it, finish this off, and stop running away, Brom. You're making a fool of yourself. I wish I had underway. I'm so jealous that I don't. Um, there we go. We should be able to auto resolve this, no problem. Yep. And we'll. Oh, we can't actually hold this. 
Huh. I figured this is in the this is in the chaos waste, so don't know why we can't. But yeah, I guess now we gotta remember not to sack anything right now because we are gonna get this eventually. Don't get me wrong, this is this is gonna be awesome. But we don't wanna have our guys down here when we do it, so we're gonna spend at least maybe we sack Actually, we're probably gonna make this an outpost, but when we when Wolfric is back up north, we are gonna start sacking again, and then we are gonna kill those armies. Let me show you that the oh, hello, Manny. Oh, you want peace? Well, actually, I think this just might be your lucky day because, uh, well. We've already killed you. How you grew your head back after I took a trophy is uh, a different story, I guess, for a different time. But, gotta say, it's an impressive trick. But since I've already done the quest I get to uh, get the, the trophy, and I've already gotten your trait, I don't see any reason to keep fighting you, because you're just gonna annoyingly probably send some stuff north from time to time. And I don't really need to fight you anymore. So, yeah. I'm okay with it. Although, <laughs> Vlad doesn't seem to think the same. But I guess uh, that's okay. I don't think he's gonna send too much. And he got a gift of Drakenhof. And I don't mind him being stronger, actually, because uh, he's fighting the Empire. So, that's okay. Okay, so... We are getting closer to help it, and we have progging the Empire around, so let's not recklessly march north. Let's take this easy. And it would be nice to get another another tick of replenishment before getting to help it. But there doesn't seem to be anyone around, so let's just... Okay, so there is a guy here, but... Oh, and there is a guy here as well, but he is pretty beat up, and I don't think they can send anything there. Well, actually, even if they can, I can just withdraw if I want to, and I'm just gonna sit here and encamp. And, ah, oh, we're almost getting there next turn. That is a little bit annoying, but, oh well, that's okay. No rush, and Krakadrak is done, so we can just... Uh, Start running you east. Yeah. Partially because, uh, well, we might just have to go and kill a goal. And uh, is Vander Mist, Vander the Mist, the w Winter Mist, the Mister Wist. Um, if we can just kill him, we'll we can just take all of his stuff. So we're just gonna send Throg to do that. Wolfric is gonna probably just race help it and then uh, we'll be at 100 and Throg can uh, like he can react to one of the armies because I think they just spawn a little bit here and there like along this coast so if Throg is just further west it's good to have him on on the ready although I don't remember how strong these armies are so I hopefully um, Throg is strong enough but usually they don't they don't have the like super insane armies and he does have some pretty strong stuff so he should probably be okay let's give him some health and bonus versus infantry and you can have razor claws and oh yeah research sure and Kislev doesn't seem to have a, <laughs> a good time against um, the Goromandi well, that's that's okay. So I am e kind of expecting to get mosh. Oh, hello. Okay, never mind. Um, there's a lot of rats around. So let's let's just go and kill these bastards because I'm just expecting to get like 50 stacks on me at once, just rushing me. And there are so many rats! Where are, where do they all keep coming from? Well, 
Okay, keep keep fleeing, I guess. You're being incredibly annoying, but that's to be expected, I suppose. Oh wait, this was Throt. Well, excellent. You got a lot of catapults. <laughs> that is a lot of them. So I think we might just might just lightning strike this because uh, this this is a lot of play class. I don't want to. Uh, I want to be able to ride behind it and just smack into them while we charge head on. I don't want another army coming in from behind and start blasting our horse masters. So we're just gonna go with the lightning strike, kill Throt. But we are definitely gonna fight this because once again, this is another champion's head to collect. So I expected more monsters from Throt. Seems like he's playing incorrectly, but... Oh, come on, that's just rude. But that's okay. Oh, I almost forgot the great weapons one. I keep forgetting about them because they look like... What the shit? They look like javelins. So... I don't think it's my fault. But I guess um, the whalers are not as necessary here then because I thought he was gonna have a bunch more monsters. That's okay. He doesn't have to have them. He can play them exactly how he wants to, but as long as he knows that he's doing it wrong, then I don't care what he does. So, can we... Yeah, we can squeeze them in over here. And we can just ride through the forest. Great! So, all of you. Attack whatever you can. Whalers, get up there. Horses. Just get to the catapults. They just need to die. Because that is basically the only thing that deals damage to us except for Throt maybe. Because Throt is a pretty good duelist. At least when he's on his monsters, but he's not on his... Uh, his... Oh, what are, what, what are the big rats called? I'm so bad at names. Um, the big rat, you know. <laughs> okay, um, just smack into these. We can break them really quick, I imagine. And we don't have any magic. Okay. Let's let's not get ahead of ourselves. I know these guys are like really good, but let's not send them in alone against an army. Although, Skaven slaves. Never mind. Okay. These are... These are all the Skaven... All the clan rats are are um, getting at, at us. Let's just rotate, get over to these play claws instead. That's fine. Where'd I put the caster? Oh, I threw them back over there. And this should be a pretty... No, oh, there we go. Okay. It was slow, but there they are. Send you over there. Get in there. You can go in there. You can go in there, actually. Good. Good, 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 good. Where's Wolfie? And over to the next one. Oh, I think we hit some horses. That's okay. But this... This isn't going well for the little... Little rats, boys. They're trying so hard. Look at them. Oh, they're trying. Oh, that was a mammoth, but... Sorry about that view. But there was nothing I can do about it. That was unavoidable. Oh, I forgot I forgot about the damn things that get summoned at the start of the battle. Every time. Oh, well, that's okay. Um, What are you? You're a clan rats. You should... You should just be breaking. And was that throat? There's throat. Let's see if we can reach that. Because the champions should be able to do some good work on them. And you can go and help. Right, and these are unbreakable. So let's... Well, that was unnecessary, but I don't think <laughs> I was going to use it any time else. I forgot he didn't have the potion anymore. 
Um, go and kill the damn plague monks. Everyone on the plague monks. Did we get off? Yeah, we got off the the Hunter of Champions. And they are in March stance, so they will be absolutely destroyed as soon as uh, this battle ends. And let's just plop that, get the damage we can. Because we have a lot of other stuff there, we don't want to... We don't want to deal unnecessary damage to our people. So let's just kill these. And... Dead. No? Dead. There we go. Okay, I feel like Kislev kind of owes me one. <laughs> because... That was... Three stacks around Fort Ostrok, and they don't have any way of dealing with that. Like, does Kislev even have any armies left? Kislev, 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 Kislev. There. Yeah, they have zero armies, so they should thank me for cleaning this shit up. Oh shit, that was a lot of damage. That's. That's not fair. And that's just. We might get assaulted by, like, four stacks here. Because there's still a lot of rats around, even though we killed two, two, well, decent stacks. But that's okay. Um, we're just gonna go the, the champion, the marauder tree, probably. And the, whatchamacallit, the mammoth tree. So, let's just start with the marauders, because we have a lot of marauders. You can have... I guess charge bonus for the entire army is pretty alright. I mean, 4% isn't really substantial, but it's not its not bad. Lower ward save. Does that... Can you have negative ward save? Or is that just um, if they have ward save, it lowers? I'm not sure. Let's just get that instead. Because there's not that many units that actually have ward save, so... That's okay. Alright, we have another gift. We can get... Okay, I don't think there's any of these that are any good. Like, speed is nice, it's fine, it's not great. Upkeep and, ca and replenishment is meh. The mana defense from Wolfric is pretty alright. The resistances is eh. And that is pretty meh. These are okay. Oh, we can just... Let's grab this. Should have gotten that earlier, because then we wouldn't have to care about a goal, but... Oh well. That is... That is how it is now. Yeah, okay, he's still sitting there, so he's very passive. But we can just keep going anyway. And they are <laughs> threatening... <laughs> threateningly looming here on the coast. Always ready for a headbutting you wanna... Contest. Join any wars... Against any of these? You hate Middleland. How about... I give you a bunch of money. Oh, 4k. No. Okay. I don't know how to get you to fight them. <laughs> They're so... Pointless. And let's upgrade our Good. I travel the world seeking. Oh yeah, Mung wants peace. They're sitting in their corner, and I'm fine with that. I know it wasn't your fault we're at war. Don't you worry about it, buddy. And let's just go and help it then. Brom doesn't really do anything. He's just going around, getting up, getting beaten up by Kislev. And I would very much like to fight this outside. So let's start by lightning striking Metastorm Hemlock. Which is a hell of a name. Yeah, I don't want to fight this in the garrison. We're gonna lightning strike this. And I guess we're gonna fight this because we're gonna take so much unnecessary damage. And we still have this to fight, so we're gonna fight it. Right, Brood Horror is the name. I remembered the name Brood Horror on those big rats, and I know this is this is way like it was a while ago I was talking about this, but the big rats, they're Brood Horrors. I just need to see the unit card, and I instantly remember the name. 
So, yeah. I love the brood horrors. I think they're so cool. Like, they are so ugly and so, like, gross. But I fucking love them. They're awesome. I just really like Skaven. Easily one of my favorite factions. They're just so much fun. They have the grossest, ugliest monsters. And they have the most fun, fun, uh, like, inventions and gadgets and stuff. And I just have to love them for it. There we go. We're gonna unselect all of you. No, there we go. <laughs> oh, dang it. These guys are three. There we go. Good. And uh, they didn't have any artillery, right? So, although the brood horrors are a hundred speed unit and they're pretty good against just chomping on cavalry, but I think we're fine just poking at these, like getting some good shots against their halberds is a good start. And you better start riding because they're lightning, lightninging your ass. But yeah, let's, it's fine if they just come one at a time, I don't mind. And we can just go and kill the Gracier if they're, if they're just letting us. And all of you, you're just gonna start killing this brood horror. Um, you are gonna go and deal with that. You're gonna deal with that. Oh, and one of you. Actually, let, we'll let them go. Keep going with that. Let's just stay close to him. Oof. Oof. These guys. They can hurt real bad, but they are... They're gone. He's gone already. Very good. Gotta love that Skaven leadership. Oh, and... Oh, this is a perfect pendulum. Do we have a Sea Fang ready? Of course we do. We haven't used Sea Fang yet. Good. Um, this is a good Sea Fang. What the shit are you? That's pretty good. Happy with that. And you're just gonna... Everything's just gonna break. Okay. Go deal with these storm vermin. Because th this is the last thing they have. And they're gonna have army losses like the second we get in here and deal some damage to them. Right? Army losses? Yes? No? Yeah, I guess not. Then we're just gonna watch them fight a little bit. Oh yeah, big old stomping elephant. Beautiful. And they're still not running. Damn guys, you got some good leadership. I mean, nothing else came back. Good, we just had to check. But they are holding. This is impressive. You're the last guys in your in your army, and you held long enough for these guys to come back. What the shit? That was army losses, and they just held through it until people came back. Well, obviously it wasn't completely army losses, but that was mostly army losses. I shouldn't have sent in the horse masters. I thought that was just gonna be an instant rout, but oh well, it's okay. Okay. That's a decent amount of money. Just run far away enough. That's good. No, that's not good. You can run farther than... Oh, come on. <laughs> what kind of... What kind of run away was that? Okay. I guess I have to finish you off. Um, surely I can auto-resolve this without taking too much damage. Doesn't look like I took a lot of damage. 61 is still probably more than I should have. And you stay nearby, thank you, because I still need you to pull out the garrison, so you stay right where you are. There we go. Now we can pull out the garrison. Still a Pyrrhic victory, but that's okay. The Hellpits are scary. The Rat Ogres are eh, fine. They are, they are probably better in uh, Grimhammer than they are normally, so... But otherwise... Most of this is actually really strong, but 
generally will be fine, probably. Oh! <laughs> oh, you stupid little idiots. Oh, this is, this is tragic. Well, their entire garrison is gonna come from there. Um, we still have to, like, let them come out a little bit, because if we rout them instantly, we're not gonna deal enough damage, so we still have to fight an actual siege battle. But... I think this will be just fine. Move up. So, let's just grab all of you. Get in there, and you especially just get in there. Wolfric, just pile on in. You can pile on in. You can just overcast on those guys. It's gonna be great. Oh, loud sound effect. There we go. Thank you. Let's pop that. Oh, we are taking a lot of damage there. Oh, this is chaos. Um, we can't find their lords. Okay, fine. Um... Sea Fang right through there, I guess. Start shooting at their big beasties, please. What are you doing over there? Get in there and kill stuff. Get in there and kill stuff. Oh, well, you get in there and kill that plague claw. What are you doing? Okay, well, I think we're dealing plenty of damage here. Oh, you need to pop some shit. When do we get our next sea fang? Still a while away. Can we find their lord? No. No lords. Just plague monks. Okay. That's okay. There's a lord though. Hey Wolfric, grab... Grab your guys. Grab your homies. We're going out on the, on the town, killing some uh, some warlocks. There we go. You ain't going nowhere, and my boys are gonna kill ya. Come on, get some hits in. How hard is this? Oh, and we need to chase this. Well, actually, we don't need to chase this. Because uh, these already ran once, right? I think so. So these are already dead. So that's good. Yeah, I thought I chased these guys once. Like they ran away when I attacked. But I guess that was just... That was... From other battles. Okay, well, they're gonna run again and that's okay. Uh, maybe we can even keep them within range of the garrison. Nah, we can't. Because that would have been a very, very free fight against Help It. But let's grab Help It. We should be able to... Yeah, we can just auto-resolve this. We outpost this. And um, we'll take some damage, sure. But we're going to have to replenish anyway. And that's going to be okay. So let's auto-resolve. Let's outpost. And... Hey, Soul Crusher. Nice. Um, what do we get rid of for Soul Crusher? Because we're 100% getting Soul Crusher in this army, like, right away. The Soul Crusher is fucking sweet. So... We can just get rid of one of the Marauder Champions or the Icehorn Marauders. Like, they're very good. But... And I do like the normal moral champions more than I like the great weapons. So... Is this worth... Like, these are so much more tanky. So, honestly, let's just get rid of, of the great weapon moral champions. Although we can just get these back. But I like those more. Yeah, okay. 
We do still have the hounds on the way, so if we need to replace something with a regiment of renown, that is just fine. And I'm gonna end this episode here. So, I think we made uh, Mulder regret plenty that they attacked us. They still have a settlement somewhere. Um, it's not that, so it's definitely this. So, next episode, we're gonna raise this and spawn the the uh, Chaos Army. And actually... Um, yeah, you can keep running. Because they could spawn over here, they could spawn over here. Either way, we're gonna hunt down one of the armies with Throg, the other with Wolfric. At least, depending on what they have. If they, if uh, Throg can't deal with them, then maybe we don't. But I'm sure they'll be, he'll be fine. And I guess we should give some, some marks as well. But we're gonna do that next episode. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, consider leaving a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.